guys, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to be doing a very natural, everyday kind of look. I asked you guys on Instagram if you wanted to see a glam look or like a no makeup makeup look and most of you voted for no makeup makeup. But I feel like I've been doing no makeup makeup videos on my channel for a while now. <laughs> I will do a full glam um, soon. My little, little sky in the background there. I've moved the cat too, so she's a bit annoyed by that. Oh, and by the way, I'm wearing the new Nella Rose Skinny Dip Collection. I got the limited edition kind of like bra top sports bra top with the cycling shorts such good quality i've got size 10 in both and um, today's post notification shout out is going to go to coils and throws so thank you so much for your sweet um comment i really appreciate it and um, if you guys want to get one next time all you have to do is subscribe press the bell button and then let me know in the comments below when you've done so or you can just leave a nice comment. Whilst I'm making this video, I thought it would be a good opportunity to try the new Fenty Beauty Bright Fix Eye Brightener. And these have been everywhere on my Instagram, so, and my TikTok. I'm gonna use this soap brow, love this stuff. I'm just gonna put a bit of MAC Fix Plus on it. There's this brow product that I've been wanting to try, which is by Refi Beauty. I've been seeing it everywhere on my Instagram, but it's all out of stock. It also gives that kind of like soap brow effect, but instantly whilst with this soap brow, I feel like if I'm like going to work and stuff, I wouldn't be using this because it just takes too long to like maneuver. But once you get it, it looks nice. But because of like time, I wouldn't, I don't think I'll be used. Anyways, I'm gonna let that dry for a bit and I'm gonna start my skin. I'm first gonna start with my Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Instant Retouch Primer. I've actually used the eye brighteners twice now two days in a row and i've realized that you need to wear eye cream because it's like a dry formula well for me at least because i have dry skin um, and it was quite dry and i didn't need to set it with powder at all so i was just putting it on my eyes just like casually with no makeup and i was seeing throughout the day don't crease but it was like really dry on my skin so um i tried it with some eye cream and it definitely made a difference so i'm gonna use the fenty skin flash snap instant revival eye cream and I'm just gonna tie this on. I also got my nails done and I can't go under my eyes. I just feel so weird. Oh god, when you get your nails done, it makes you feel like a, a new woman. I just got these simple like acrylics. I went in thinking I'm gonna get all these like patterns and stuff. I saw this and I'm like, just keep it like that. I don't want anything else. Okay. I don't know. Even though like this is the best time to experiment with colours because I'm not in the office, like I can just go all out. No, your girl just stay with a nude acrylic. And this is just acrylic powder. I didn't put any gel or anything. So because this is like a no makeup makeup look, we're going to skip foundation. But we're going to put a little bit of the uh, East Drop uh, skin tint. I'm going to use the shade 14. Um, I might use a bit of 12 as well just to show you guys. I gave 13 to my sister. But I do have a full review on this, by the way. I'm not going to put too much on the under eyes because we want to see like the eye brightener stuff, right? I'm just going to put 12 on the center, just a little bit. Now with this stuff, if you want like a bit of coverage, I feel like you can definitely get it. So I really put a little bit of this stuff just to get that kind of like skin-like finish. And I'm just going to go with 14 all over. I cannot just, I cannot process the fact that it's may already like what where has this year gone my skin has definitely because i've been up in my skincare doing more masks more scrubs exfoliating it's really looking quite good the only thing that's bugging me is this so next we have the bright fix eye brightener um i have peach deep melon and deep butter so we're gonna want to swatch these they have this really cool globe applicator so the shades i have is peach deep melon and deep butter i like to go in with this first and then to go in with deep butter on top it's a bit bright but it works for me so i'm going to use the fenty beauty 180 concealer brush so i'm just gonna burn this all out I just like to finish it with my finger. Okay, now I'm gonna go with a bit of deep butter and just use my finger to bend that out. I just work between my finger and a brush to be honest because I feel like a sponge would kind of remove 
most of this because it's so light like it's very lightweight it's very light coverage and what this stuff is supposed to do is really like brighten the eyes and it just does that but it stays really natural put a little bit more in the corner okay so that's both eyes done now this um claims to instantly hydrate brighten and conceal it's light as air sheer to buildable coverage um and it's coverage that lasts um it's definitely light as air you barely feel this this is definitely for people who loves that no makeup makeup look i would say the coverage is sheer to light i wouldn't say it's like buildable um but it definitely brightens my under eye um i don't really have that much pigmentation under my eyes so if you if you do then the peach can help but um i don't think it will give enough coverage to give that flawless under eye if that's what you're looking for this is just for every day for, for me personally um and i actually don't need to set it with powder i just leave it as is they have 16 shades it holds moisture to the skin mm, i don't agree with that because it's really drying for me i'll put a picture here of what it looks like uh, by the end of the a full day and it was looking pretty good to be honest so yeah if you're looking for full coverage this is not for you but you know for every day i do definitely see myself wearing this to work i don't want to wear tart shape tape every day because that's proper full coverage and it gives me flawless under eyes without fault um but this is definitely more like skin like eye brightening like kind of thing you know i'm gonna go in with a bit of my fenty beauty sunstalker bronzer in the shade island ting I used to use Caramel Cutie but I've run out but to be honest I'm at my playlist so it doesn't really matter but I forgot how good these bronzers are. I'm just going to put a little bit of blush I still want to keep that like skin like finish and this is the Cheeks Out Drama Class blush cream blush by Fenty Beauty and I like to just use this with my finger. I know you'd be like why is she wearing a lilac blush but this just looks so beautiful especially on like tan to deeper skin tones. It's so hard to open stuff with my nails I need to get used to it but I'm just gonna quickly just roughly fill my brows up. I'm gonna put a bit of my Benefit Magnet uh, mascara. I'm just gonna put a little bit. And then for lips, I'm going to go in with the new Huda Beauty Lip Contour 2.0 in the shade Terracotta. I'm going to use the new Maybelline Lip to Gloss in the shade Amber. These have hyaluronic acid in them and it just gives this like really plump look to the lips. I've actually got a video um, call that work so I love, this is a perfect day to do like a no makeup makeup look. But this is what you guys wanted, I kept it very very natural. And these Fenty Bright Fix eye brighteners came at the right time. Um, and I'm glad I tried them before doing a review on them so I can really just tell you guys how I personally like to wear them. Um, so for me it's like uh, a good eye cream and no powder because it's already drying for me. But they're going to be $25 which will be around like £22. Um, which is not bad for a high end concealer. All I'm going to say is a little goes a long way to get that brightening under eye effect. It's just a little close up. I really like it. It does blur a little bit too. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments below what you would like to see next. Make sure to hit the like button because it really helps your girl out. And subscribe so you can join the family. Um, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!